The Ball Aerospace Ralph instrument is getting closer and closer to Pluto for the first ever flyby on July 14th. Ball's Ralph camera will return the best images we've ever seen of the dwarf planet. Just how good will they be? If we were to fly by the Earth with the same resolution, we could count the ponds in Central Park in Manhattan with the resolution of the Ball built camera. Using images of Mars, Ball's lead optical engineer for Ralph, Jim Baer, demonstrates what we'll see leading up to the July 14th flyby by comparing pixels we can see week by week. This is four pixels across, and you sample it and smooth it out. This is sort of what you get, where this has now got 16 pixels across. Somewhere between five and 10 days before we get there, this is the kind of resolution you start to see shapes, and now you're getting to real data. The Ralph instrument consists of three black and white and four color imagers with telescopic resolution 10 times better than the human eye. This is the direct comparison of, the, of a eight pixel image smooth to a full resolution image. We are right now blurrier than this. When we get there, we'll be much sharper than this. Our best images of Pluto were taken by ball instruments built for the Hubble Space Telescope. But the tiny dwarf planet is about to get its close-up. We'll put our 5,000 pixels across this strip and make one giant image, like the picture of Jupiter. We took, as we passed it in 2007, which is the highest resolution single image of Jupiter ever taken. After the flyby of Pluto, New Horizons will continue cruising through the Kuiper Belt to make still more observations.